and welcome into today's episode um, of CHP Officer 20 LSPDFR San Andreas. Today we're going to join a brand new face to the series for uh, under the skies of Robert 20. Uh, we're going to go with uh, Deputy Simmons here. He's going to be on the right. Um, and we have to his left, his partner, uh, Deputy May. One Robert 20 dispatch. Show me 1041 10 8. Acknowledged. One Robert 20. Proceed to patrol area. Okay. Get our radar turned on. Uh, we'll put it. Um, yeah, one of the things I don't do is I don't I don't go after the golf carts. Officers report a suspect resisting arrest in right. the Alamo Sea. Gunfire reported. Alamo Sea. All units respond. Dispatch, we got eyes. We're in pursuit. They're on the other side. Ten four. Dispatch, we got eyes. We're in pursuit. Requesting air support. Dispatch air unit over Grande Sonora Desert. This is Albatross 3 headed towards suspect. Eagle 1, we see the suspect. He's headed north. Wanted to make sure I got that uh, air support unit out there. I forgot my siren would have been reset back to the originals. That sucks. Siren sounds anything uh, but good. Sounds like it's a dying cat. Okay, we're we're in approach. Don't mind me. I just got to go completely off road. Oh, well. Oh, well. Signal 100, dispatch. Okay, I'm taking that as a little bit personal. Be advised, dispatch, we have eyes on the suspect. We're going to be uh, southbound Calafia Road. Vehicle's going to be a uh, uh, delivery van of sorts. Uh, it's going to be uh, on the order of about six times occupied. I'm all over this guy's back end, and uh, their shots fired. Whoa! Hello. Requesting pursuit backup. Roger that. Backup required in Zancudo River. Requesting spike strip. Be advised, dispatch. Be advised, dispatch. You just hit a guy off the squad. Officer down, officer down. Attention all units near Zancudo River. Respond code three. Perp located in pursuit. Okay, now it's personal. Dispatch suspect is involved with a collision. Yeah. Get the fuck out of that car right now! The suspect on foot. Are located in pursuit. Requesting backup. Dispatch. Screw it. <laughs> oh my god. Robert 20 dispatch. Cancel signal 100. Okay. 
Okay. Uh, guys, let's go ahead and get clear, clear these guys out of here, please. Um, I don't even know. How many 1016s do I bloody need? Uh, two? Two. Requesting 1016. Roger. Transport required. Assistance required in Zancudo River. I don't even know who said that. I don't even... I'm not even interested to find out who. Careful, partner. You want... Okay. Robert 20 dispatch requesting 1052. Ambulance assistance required in Zancudo River. Okay, nothing of interest there. This guy's deciding to go off road. He's going across the river. Robert 20 dispatch requesting 1028. Four six Edward Edward King five seven two. License plate. Four six Edward Edward King five seven two. Target is ten four. There it is. How are you managing to hit every goddamn thing on the map? Oh, hell. Robert 20 dispatch requesting 1051. Jesus Christ. No. Uh, Deputy Simmons. Flatbed assistance required in Zancudo River. Uh, Robert 20 dispatch. We can have uh, officers standing by at uh, Pillbox Hill. Um, Take security over incoming prisoners. It's not looking good. Well, all I gotta say about that is that escalated quick. Okay, so we got one. One down. Actually, no. Changing the siren tone is going to be, not be an ASAP. It's going to be, um, as they say, PDQ pretty damn quick. Yeah, well, if I'm not mistaken, that might be the one who got out and started shooting at my partner. Uh, Robert 20 dispatch requesting coroner. Assistance required in Zancudo River. You know, logically, you just drive straight and not try the three point turn there, Austin Powers. Okay, coroners have seen. There it is. following this guy for a little bit. Looked like he kind of swerved. A robbery with a firearm in uh, 
10-4, show Robert 20, code 3. Like I said, I'm not used to, I'm not used to, uh, non-ELS yet. won't be soon enough. I I didn't even think about the update and I didn't even think about what it could possibly do to my audio file. Oh my god, I'll never forget I I will never forget changing that thing out again during an update. Robert 20 dispatch, show me 1023. 10 4 10 23. Is backup required? A firm. Roger that. Backup required in uh, the Humane Lab facility. We'll keep our eyes filled, dispatch. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and unlock my rifle here. Thank you. <laughs> We're going into battle on armed robbery, and she's going in with a pistol. You know. Okay, guys, you ready? Let's go ahead and stack up this way. Where's the other car? Come here. Don't follow me so close. Shit. Roger, dispatch. We are en route. Charlie 4, roger that. We'll look for those maggots. Well, that escalated. As we got the cavalry coming in. That guy wasn't fooling around with his armaments, was he?
Robert 20 dispatch requesting 1052. Ambulance, assistance required in the Humane Lab facility. Uh, after you seeing what they were using for armaments, I'm guessing probably not. Okay, so yeah, I mean this is this was just a legit bloodbath. Um, I took some damage. Looks like I took some damage. Well, they get, they got me a ton on the vest. Um, I took some damage there on the arm. My poor Tahoe. Robert Twenty Dispatch, show me back uh, ten eight. Whoa. Robert 20 dispatch requesting 1028. Well, that's cool. I just saw the microphone, the the uh, receiver in his hand. 24 George Charles Lincoln 360. George Charles Lincoln 360. A traffic violation. Approach with caution. Okay, expired insurance. Not the end of the world. Robert 20 dispatch. Show me 1011. Or not, and I'll just uh, do it the old-fashioned way, right? Go ahead. One, Robert, 20, 10, 4, Anna, 10, 11, in Santiansky Mountain Range. How you doing today, ma'am? My name's uh, Deputy Simmons with the uh, Blaine County Sheriff's Office. My partner over there is uh, Deputy May. Um, do you have your license, registration, proof insurance? So you're gonna show me There we go. Okay. So Thank you. insurance is expired by more than a year. Um, license is still valid and registration will be expiring at the end of uh, in about two months. Okay, ma'am. Uh, so the reason for the stop here today is just as we're coming up on the U tool, uh, couldn't help but notice the way you uh, made a very hard and aggressive turn to the side. Um, and uh, just wanted to make sure everything's okay with the vehicle. Didn't want wanted to make sure you didn't blow a tire uh, and things like that. Um, have, you haven't been drinking or anything, right? Okay. Uh, any drugs? Prescription, otherwise? Okay. Um, 
Okay, since you did indicate that you have been drinking, uh, we I am going to be inclined to conduct a field sobriety test uh, once I return back from the, my vehicle. Um, and then as long as you come back good, we'll uh, let you move ahead. If uh, not, we'll have to play it by ear. Understand? Okay. Uh, I'll be right back. Go ahead and set type for me. And uh, Miss Star and uh, my partner will be here if you have any questions. Okay. So she did admit that... Um, she did admit that she has been drinking. Um, and that she's feeling high as a kite right now. So, I, I mean, I, I don't know. I mean, that's honest for damn sure. And I like honesty. Um, but I don't know if that's something I would have admitted straight up. <laughs> but to, to each their own. I mean, you know, at the end of the day, I'm going to say thank you for your honesty and move ahead. Um, so, let's go ahead and take a look at Miss uh, Star. Uh, she has a valid license, no issues, no worries. Um, leaving the scene of an accident and expired license, but those are just, those are like two years old now, so I'm not really going to hold her up to that. Um, honestly, you know, um, I don't know, what was her other, uh, leaving the scene of an accident? Well, I guess that kind of ties in with a careless driving. Um, she's definitely going to get insurance, but I can even I can work with her on that. Because for the fact that her registration is still valid and not um, um, and not put on hold, you know, not suspended or put on hold, and her license is still valid and it's not suspended by the DMP for no insurance, tells me that. Uh, she her fees are on file and uh, they and there's nothing outstanding. So she is making the mandatory payment in lieu of insurance. So that's what that's telling me. So um, it's not going to save her from not getting an expired insurance ticket. But that's a little bit different than no insurance. Okay, ma'am, can you go ahead and do me a favor and step out of the vehicle, please? Okay. Hold up. Perfect, ma'am. Uh, do me a favor. Uh, follow me this way, okay? Okay, ma'am, so the first thing we're going to do here today is I'm going to have my partner go ahead and patch you down just for your safety and ours. Um, uh, do you have anything on you? Shouldn't have drugs, weapons, knives, guns, anything? Is there a poke stick or my partner in any way? Well, I ask because, ma'am, if you hurt my partner, I'm going to take it really personal. Go ahead, partner. So we got our body cam on. Um... We are also kind of getting picked up on dash cam, but this way we have our body cam going. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Thank you, ma'am. Okay. So our first uh, field sobriety test here today first is going to be called a horizontal gaze. What you're going to do is you're going to look at the tip of this uh, pen and you're going to follow it with your eyes only. Understand? Okay. We'll begin now. So what we're watching is no head movement, eyes only. Okay, it looks like she's okay there. Thank you, ma'am. Uh, next one is going to be called the walk and turn. So what you're going to do is you're going to go out 10 paces, um, heel to toe. You're going to turn and pivot on the opposite foot from which you start. You're going to come back 10 paces, and then you're going to end on the same foot you, you started with. Understand? Okay. Go ahead and start when you're ready. OK, 
Okay. Looks she looked past it to me anyway, so. Okay, ma'am, final test is gonna be the one legged stand. You're gonna pick whatever leg you think you can complete the test best with, and you're going to count one thousand one, one thousand two, one thousand three, all the way to ten, okay? Start when you're ready. Okay, perfect, ma'am. I uh, thank you for your cooperation thus far. Uh, our final thing we're going to do is we're going to complete the breathalyzer. Uh, ever take a breathalyzer before? No? Okay. Uh, in the breathalyzer, you're going to blow into the end of this device. You're going to hear some beeps. It's going to keep beeping while you're blowing hard. Uh, then it's going to click. When it clicks, I'm going to tell you to stop. Uh, just keep blowing hard and don't stop till I tell you, okay? Okay, go ahead and blow, blow, blow. Doing good, doing good. And stop. Point oh, zero 0.048. Okay, so that is a particular number. So even though she passed three of the four uh, parts of the field sobriety test, the fourth one, she didn't outright fail to where we would arrest her, but she did fail to give her a wet record. Um, and also, I don't feel comfortable with her driving away from the scene, given the fact from what I witnessed, and um, so on. Okay, uh, ma'am, go ahead and stay right here with my par partner, and um, I'll be right back. So, I do not feel secure with her actually driving away from the scene. Um, I feel that her driving away could be a big problem. Um, so, nope, not speed. Gonna be rest. Uh, it's gonna be. I'm gonna say improper lane change. I'm. I'm gonna. I'm trying to work with her because she's been cooperative. So, improper lane change. Um. Uh, of course, you will also get documentation um, for expired uh, insurance. And she is going to get wet reckless for the... Um, Okay, ma'am, I got I got some um, documentation here for you. First citation is going to be for um, first citation is going to be for the improper lane change. Uh, I decided to cite you for that instead of anything that would carried with it a, a misdemeanor or felony charge because um, you've been cooperative. I I have gone ahead and I'm trying to work with you. Uh, your insurance is expired and it's expired for a year. The reason I'm not making more of a federal case out of that is because uh, I'm not seeing your license as, as suspended uh, for non-payment of insurance, not carrying of insurance. Your registration is still valid, which tells me you have pay, you have your fees all up to date. Um, and of course, for the point zero four eight, you are being cited for wet reckless. Uh, these are traffic citations. Uh, court information is on the front. It's going to be the same for all three. Uh, court date is going to be for uh, three weeks from today. It at, at, uh, looks like uh, 5 o'clock down in the... Uh, uh, it's going to be at the county courthouse uh, up here in um, uh, Polito. I just need your signature on the bottom of each of these tickets, ma'am. That's not an admission of guilt. Um just says you acknowledge everything I've told you and you agree to take care of it in court. 
Uh, well, you can take care of, since they are traffic citations, you can take care of them by mail or online. But at the nature of the wet reckless, you're going to lose your license. Um, you could arbitrarily lose your license for up to a year. So you're going to probably want to actually go to court with a lawyer and handle that. But how you wish to handle it, that's your, that's your deal. <laughs> okay, man. Here's your information back, your copies of the tickets. Um, because of based on how I saw you drive, I am not comfortable with you getting back in that vehicle. So uh, you're more than welcome to call a taxi or somebody else. Okay, you'll go, you'll do a taxi? Okay. So let's go ahead and get a taxi for you. Do you have somebody who can come and pick up the vehicle? Your brother? Okay, yeah, no problem. Assistance required on a uh, Sonora freeway. Okay, so. I try not to arrest when I can. You know, work with them. Citizens report a robbery at the Harmony 24 7 market. Units respond code 3. That's a 10. 10 4. Show Robert 20 in response. Code 3 to Harmony. Okay, so we have a robbery at the 24-7 here in Harmony. Target last seen on foot in Harmony. Requesting air support. Dispatch air unit over Grande Sonora Desert. There he is. We have eyes. Dispatch signal 100. There he is. Be advised, we have a Caucasian male, uh, no shirt, carrying a black duffel bag. Sir, hands up right now. Taser deployed. Hands up. Partner, do you have an automatic... Jail, you have an automatic rifle. My partner's not fucking around, is she? <laughs> That's my partner. <laughs> How you doing, sir? Okay. So, um, rob any good stores lately? You don't know what I'm talking about? I bet. Got anything on you? Shouldn't have drugs, weapons, knives, guns, anything that's stick, prick, poke, hurt me, piss me off in any way? Terrorist mask, a screwdriver, and a ballpoint pen. Or a ballpoint. 
either way. A pair of panties, huh? Well, that'll work. Robert 20 dispatch. Requesting 1027. Jason Forrest, 10997. Can I do anything with that duffel? Okay, sir. So here's what's going to happen. We're going to go back to the 24-7. And, uh... Because you're, you're saying you didn't rob anyone. Okay. Well, we're going to go back to the 24-7. And we're going to have to... Um, and we're going to see if the clerk can ID you. If the clerk IDs you, you're going with us. If the clerk doesn't, I'll apologize and take the cuffs off. How's that? Why you would stop behind me, I don't I do not know. Okay. Last chance to be honest with me. Hey, okay, that's up to you, sir. Ah, hello. This guy look familiar? Yeah? He was just in here a moment ago, huh? Well, there it is. Um, may, uh, may you want to go ahead and get their name, information, and statement, and I'll go ahead and put this choker back in the uh, vehicle. Okay, so um, you've been uh, positively ID'd at the scene there, sir. So at this time, you're going to be facing uh, charges of, um, uh, of robbery. You're going to be facing charges of robbery. You're going to be facing charges of... Uh, uh, attempting to uh, elude peace officers, uh, resisting arrest, obstruction of justice. Um, and that's just what I could think of while I'm not pissed off. Okay, so. Um, his only his only black mark on his record was a with a traffic citation. Going to get a little bit more serious nowadays. Um. Um, he did have the woman, the, like, it didn't, it says panties and not nylons, like for the old fashioned bank robbery thing, but uh, I didn't find a weapon on him. Um. So I think I, well, no, well, there is um, resisting and obstruction. 
Unfortunately, the only felony evasion really isn't applicable because he wasn't driving a vehicle. So, but that's good enough. Okay, we'll go ahead and put you right over here. Okay, sir. Hey, Sarge. Uh, guy has not been Mirandaized yet because I wasn't interested in really in talking to him. Um, he does, uh, His paperwork's right here in the cell uh, uh, between these two bars. Okay, yep, there you go. Thank you. Okay, guys, so that will do it for this episode. Thank you for being here. Um, started out with a huge, huge start to the episode. Uh, um, you know, I love it when it starts like that. It's just a lot of action. So overall, great time, and thank you for being here. And um, sorry about the siren. I completely forgot that uh, the update to 2060 reset my siren and I just net I have it on there as a pretty damn quick PDQ uh, to uh, get it fixed and get it taken out of there uh, that will be taken care of by next time uh, until then this is one Adam 20 for Robert 20 Deputy Simmons and Deputy May saying one Adam 20 to dispatch show me 1042 107 Ten four, copy that.